So hi there, Bob. How's it going? Hi there, Chris. Yeah, I'm good. So Henry told me you have a car you want me to look at in my garage? Yeah, I bought this SL550 from Paulie's. I had it cheap. Wait, wait, wait. wait. You went to Paulie's for that? You know Paulie's are crook, right? Yeah, but he gave me uh, a good deal, man. It was, It's always all right. Well, we'll have a look at it and see what we can do. All sure, right? yeah. Okay. So this is the infamous SL550 from Maisto that Bob bought from Pauly in the last episode. Clearly, it has seen better days. There's cruft marks all over it. At some point, I'm pretty sure this car was dropped on the floor or left unattended with a child. But we're gonna disassemble it and try to put it back to its original state. The interior of this car is absolutely trash. There was an attempt to clean it up before selling it, but to be honest, it failed miserably. can see here the driver's side seat was not assembled correctly my guess is it was a defect from the factory for the cleaning i use my favorite product scrubbing bubble and a baby toothbrush. To restore the paint finish to its original state, I will use Meguiar's Ultimate Compound and I will use it very lightly because this product is powerful.
We're gonna call Bob. Hey Chris, how are you? Hey Bob, your car's ready. That was a lot of work because that stinky black stuff inside was some sort of kitchen grease mixed with cat and dog hair. Very nasty stuff. How much did you pay for that car, man? I got it for $25. You got robbed, man. I can tell you that these cars were sold new for $25 back in 2013. And I spotted a nice one at my collector's shop for that exact price. And it came with the correct box. So you should really go back to Polly's and try to get your money back. Don't worry. If he doesn't take it back, I'll send my wife. For sure. Henry will bring it back to you and there will be a bill in the glove compartment. So good luck with the rest, man. Thanks, man. Bye bye. I'll see you. Wow. Looks good. It still stinks, boss. I still don't want it. Maybe you should listen to Chris and take it back to Paulie's. Yeah, honey. You should listen to Chris. He's always right. Did you hear that, honey? If he doesn't take it back, I'll take care of him. All right, you guys won. Let's go to Paulie's. Hey, Paulie. Well, well, well. If it isn't the guy I told to never come back. How you doing, Bob? You told me a little buffin and this car would be like new, but Chris had to tear it down completely to clean it, and it still stinks of cat pee. I want my money back, Polly. Hey, I only sell quality models, no junk. Come on, man, I'm sure we can work something out. Look, I can get the car back from you and give you store credit. To what amount? $25? No, 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 the current value of this car is $10. Are you trying to rob me blind? Okay, okay, $15. But wait, come back in two weeks. I promise you a very nice car. Your wife will love it, promise. I got a 2013 SL63 AMG coming in. Brand new, brand new, never, no, no brand okay, new. Okay, okay, call me when you get it and I'll have a look at it and we'll see. Okay, take care of yourself, Bob. So I guess we'll see each other in two weeks. Thanks for watching.